Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do numbers 94, binary tree in order traverser. This is an easy level problem on Likud and we're going to solve it in JavaScript. We're giving the root of a binary tree, return the in order traverser of its nodes values. So we can look at here, here's the tree and it starts off with the val and it has a left and a right. So in this case, it starts off with one as the val here and then the left, there's nothing there, so it has a null. And then the right, it has a two there. And then the two has a three as the left, and that's where the tree ends. So we wanna create an in-order traversal. So when we do in-order traversal, let's create a note here. That means when we traverse the tree, we go left. We pretty much go all the way left. And then once left is null, there's no pointer like here we go up one to, to add that to our array. So left, and then we go up to the middle node and then right. So left, node, right. So then once we have this idea, the strategy we're gonna use is a recursive approach. So first thing we, we need to do is that it looks like we're returning it in an array. So we have to create the results. Create results array. And this is what we're gonna put all our values into. Next, we're gonna create our recursive function and we can call it traverse, create traverse function. And inside of here, First thing we can do is that we can check if it's null or not. And if it's null, we just go up the call stack and we turn null and move on. So if node is null, return. Next, since we're going the left side first, we have to check if the left side exists. If node, and we can see here, this is where we're getting the left from. And the left exists, call traverse node.left. And then we do that all the way until it returns null. And next we push that node value into the results. So we're gonna push it, the, the value into the results. And then lastly, for the traverse function, we need to, if no dot right exists, call traverse node dot right. And then after this, we call traverse function and then we return results. Great, so let's put this in code. First thing we need to do is create the results array. Right. Results equals an empty array. Next, we create this traverse function. So conf traverse equals takes in a node. And the first thing we want to do is check if node is null. If node equals null, return. Next, we want to check if we want to go to the left side. If node dot left exists, we traverse node dot left. So we'll keep doing this until it goes to null on the left side. And then when it does go to null, we push it to the results array. Results dot push node dot val. Remember node dot val is what we're getting here. And then, so if we go left, middle node and then right. So if node dot right, traverse node dot right. And until we go 
we keep doing that until we iterate the entire tree. And so we have to call it. And we're calling it with the root. And then the last step is that we return results. Great, we got it. And then for the time and space complexity, time we see we're traversing through the entire tree. So we're gonna do O of N and the space complexity is also gonna be O of N because we're using recursion and we're creating pretty much a function as we traverse the entire tree. So that's how you solve this problem. Thank you.